today's morning minute, it already exists. We read in Romans chapter 4, verse 17 in the Amplified, as it is written, I have made you the father of many nations. He has appointed our father in the sight of God in whom he believed, who gives life, who gives life to the dead and speaks and speaks of the non-existent things that he has foretold and promised as if they already exist. Let me just read that part again. Who gives life to the dead and speaks of the non-existent things that he has foretold, foretold and promised as if they already exist. Are you speaking by giving life or death? Are you speaking of non-existent things as if they already exist? God is the creator of everything in the heavens and earth. That which is non-existent, dead, he has created, waiting for someone to believe that it already existed, life. It has already been creating, created, waiting for someone to believe that it exists, life. God has given vision and purpose for your life, your family, your marriage, your children, your work, your ministry, your community, and your church. He gives life to the dead. The prodigal son was dead in his sin of rebellion and came to life through repentance and forgiveness. Some relationships look dead, yet God wants it to be alive. Some job, business deal, career opportunity looks hopeless, hopelessly dead, yet God has already promised it as if it already existed. That circumstance, problem, relationship, or issue which looks dead, God gives life. That which is non-existent speaks as if it already exists. Life and death is in the power of the tongue. God is the creator of all and came to give life, to restore and redeem life, to reconcile all unto him. God is in the business of giving life to the dead. He gives life to those that have lost hope. He gives life to the abused. He gives life to the rejected. He gives life to the oppressed. He gives life to the defeated and downcast. He gives life to the hurt. He gives life to the fearful. God's vision is eternal. Man is born with temporary, short-sighted vision. The Holy Spirit is in you, gives you life, hope, joy, and eternal perspective. That which looks dead, God gives life, but only to those who believe. God is building his government, holy nation, kingdom, through his citizens who were once dead and are now alive. God's economy, holy nation, and kingdom have existed from the beginning. Walk as citizens, knowing that all your sins have been forgiven, past, present, and future, and you are the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. Receive all that God has for you today. Amen and amen.